Hello, it's Pupmeister, and today we are playing Superhacks.io. You know how much I love Splix.io. Well, this is basically the same thing, only instead of having to be in perpendicular lines, you can basically draw it any way you want with your mouse. Same rules apply. If someone hits your line, you're dead. Now I did notice one thing that's much easier to do in this game, as opposed to Splix, is it's a lot easier to kind of hit head, ver head on head, so to speak. Um, and kill you both. <laughs> now this guy has his own little pattern going here. As you can tell, if you hit someone in the lines, they die, just like in Splex. It takes a little getting used to because you're controlling it with your mouse instead of your arrow keys or WASD keys, whatever the case may be. So it does take a little getting used to. And sometimes it's not as controllable as I would like. But it gets the job done. <laughs> Now, I haven't been playing too, too much. I think this is a fairly new game. Um, haven't been playing too long. In fact, just a little over two minutes. And I'm already in sixth place. So, I guess, I guess it depends how many kills you get as well. Because kills certainly stack up your points. And if you get a big section like that, it's 150 points. So if I do one more chunk like that, assuming and hoping no one spawns, of course. There you go. So I've moved up to fourth position after that kill. Let's see if I can get into first position before the game is over. <laughs> that's, that's not too bad of a goal. We'll see, kind of again, it depends. If someone all of a sudden spawns in a bad spot. Oh, yikes. Oh, he just died. Ah, there's a guy. You gotta be, gotta be a little careful. Now, the other thing that I'm not too thrilled about in this game is that there's no real map. So you can't tell where your opponents are. or even where you are located in the big scheme of things. Any of that. And battles that are head-to-head -head are much tougher on this game because it's a little harder, as I mentioned before, it's a little harder. Well, some people like, they prefer the mouse. But I just, I find it a little harder to control to the same extent as uh, the other one. Although, I mean, if you're watching, it, it looks like I have great control. <laughs> I keep killing people and stuff. But um, I do, I find it a little more difficult to control. Because, and especially if your mouse or your arrow... Um, or cursor, whatever you want to call it, if it goes off the screen, 
So, I mean, the Hexio screen is, you know, X, X amount big. And then there's, you know, other things like outside your, your screen, like your, your bar and your other stuff. And if it goes off the screen, then you no longer control your guy. So you have to be careful because if it goes off the screen, you might as well be toast. Well, there you go. I'm in first place. So that goal has been achieved. So I don't know. Let's see if we can break 10,000. Again, I really don't know where I am on this map. And I believe the map is a huge hexagon, just like all the little hexagons in the game. So I must be, I'm obviously on the left side somewhere. And now I'm in one of the corners. So it gives me a rough idea where I am. But, you know, if you're trying to link up with somebody you're playing with, it could be a little difficult <laughs> when you don't know where you are. I haven't really seen anybody else for a while. And you can't even... Uh, start working towards somebody because you don't know where anybody is or where any when where anyone is or where they are uh oh oh lucky such a lucky boy gotcha that time all right Still looking for more people. Hello out there. Anyone around? Somewhere? Well, like I said, one of the things I do not like is that you can't tell where anybody is. So, makes it tough when you're trying to look for somebody. Or in this case, anybody. It only gives you the top 10. Of course, most games only do that. But this one, I guess, yeah, it tells you. There's only, I guess right now, there's only 36 people playing. So, there's not a ton of people on. And I just got rid of one. It's a little risky, but I did it. Very close to breaking 10,000. Oh, there's somebody else. Let's see if we can work our way over. I don't know if there's really anything else to tell you when it comes to this game oh that was a mistake buddy and but thank you very much you got me over 10,000 so i mean you have your little you have your little scoreboard in the top left corner so it does tell you what number you are if you're not in the top 10 it tells you what number you are of how many people are playing so right now i'm number one of 20 it's getting less and less where'd this guy go 
There he is, way over there. I still don't like getting too close to the end there. <clears throat> and it's a little harder. Oh, I think I didn't get him. I think he killed himself. He crashed into the wall. But that's why I don't get too close to the wall, because it's dangerous. Oh, here's another guy. Oh, just made it. Gotcha. Well, we're up to 11,400. You never know when someone's going to spawn. So if you do a long line, you could very easily be writing your own death certificate, if you know what I mean. Number one of 20. Now, there are times when this server basically has just as many people as Splicks on it. You know, maybe 70 to 80 people playing at a time. But I just happened to pick a moment when, unless it's closing, you know how Splix kind of closes and kills you when you don't want to <laughs> if they're closing the server? And slowly everybody disappears. I hope that's not what's that's not what ha is happening. That's, that would kind of suck. Gabby. Gotcha. All right, so we're up to twelve thousand nine hundred. Now there's only seventeen people. Maybe I shouldn't have killed Gabby. I can use everybody I can get. Oh, here's somebody. Here's another person. This guy could be pretty big, considering. I don't. He looks pretty big. I'll see how close. Wow, yeah, he does look pretty big, actually. Although it can't be that big, because the highest guy is only 3,600. So maybe he's just slightly... Out. Oh, there he is. I killed deer. Number eight. So I guess he's not as big as I thought. I killed deer. What a bizarre name. What is he, like a super proud hunter or something? Who doesn't like deer? Oh, there he got me. He got me. But I'm not even a deer. Oh, well. <laughs> so I finished off the game in first place. It gives you the map results. I had 8.1% of the map, which is not bad. Almost 10% of the map. Over 7,000 blocks, 13 kills, and a score of 13,570. So this is not a bad game. It's a little more uh i don't know maybe not quite as intense as splix but it has its intense moments obviously especially if you're going head to head with someone but uh overall not a bad game um i'm almost starting to play it just as much as splix but i still i still enjoy splix it's just when splix gets all those glitches that uh it makes it not so much fun but then, now I have a new place to go. So anyway, this was Hex Superhex.io. Superhex.io. So thanks for being with us today, and you have yourself a great day.
Bye for now.